Performance. Good morning and welcome to Breakfast with Dan Wangstein and Sally Numbnuts. Once again, we're here banging on about Russia and Ukraine as we report the latest distraction, not the news. All while you sit there, freezing your tits off, unable to pay the rising costs that's now seeing the government talk about power rationing just like in the 1970s. Because eventually you're going to own nothing and you will be happy, you filthy peasants. Yes, here at the Bolshevik Brainwashing Corporation, we think it's much more important to distract you with something happening thousands of miles away instead of what really matters to you. It's a bit like this story here, where we have the President Zelensky appearing at the Grammys because he's an actor playing his part, so he needed to do a bit of airtime for that. You all know I'm a comedian, but you should believe the bullshit I spew in front of my green screen because the media has told you to, like they did with Bat Flu, you gullible fuck pigs. Today we will promote stories about emergency service workers who die in the line of duty despite us openly supporting the mostly peaceful BLM riots in 2020 which actually left many officers severely injured and all ended with BLM Sasha Johnson being shot in the head with a mostly peaceful bullet while attending a very diverse house party we couldn't blame on white man bad. This morning, instead of reporting on boat wankers invading the country, we'll talk about a 40p increase on egg prices because this is more important to the public than the commie servitives importing after world daily. This includes 15,000 Ukrainians a day, all at your bloody expense, as you should know. Yes, the daily hotel bill must be topping 7 million a day by now, but instead of talking about that, we'll bang on about eggs because at the BBC we love importing illegal economic migrants or refugees as we like to call them. And finally for the weather, today will be wet and windy but it's not the rain causing these downpours, it's us pissing in your pocket and telling you it's raining as we always do. 